Urban investigator Jason Knowles is here with more about one group's battle. Jason. Rob, Judy, it is a speed camera fight over when a ticket can be issued by a camera. Right now, drivers can get one for going between 6 to 10 miles per hour over the limit. This is not a program that benefits safety. The group Citizens to Abolish Red Light Cameras is pushing to change when the city's 162 speed cameras can be used. The group says the current law of targeting drivers going between 6 and 10 miles per hour over the speed limit is unfair, saying it has the greatest impact on working class commuters and in communities of color. There are people who have complaints, seniors, that they have never gotten a ticket before in their entire lives, that have gotten multiple $35 tickets in the mail before they knew that they had the first ticket. Drivers used to only get speed camera fines if they were going 10 miles per hour over the speed limit. Now, six miles above the speed limit gets you a ticket, a change made by Mayor Lightfoot. In November, the ABC7 data team analyzed speed camera tickets issued since that law changed. We found that the city issued a total of 1,027,414 tickets with fines. 84% of all those tickets were for driving 6 to 10 miles per hour over the speed limit. In fact, the number of tickets issued increased threefold when the speed limit decreased. This is a program that needs to come to an end. The city says safety studies justify the use and placement of speed cameras, and there's been a reduction in crashes near them. Alderman Anthony Beal introduced an ordinance to go back to the original law and only ticket drivers going 10 miles per hour over the speed limit. That ordinance is currently stalled in city council committee, but Beal is hoping to present it to the full city council tomorrow. Rob, Judy, we will keep an eye on this and let you know what happens. That's that, an eye-opening stat. That number for the new tickets issued? Yeah, that's pretty dramatic. A lot of money. People right. are tired of paying. Okay. Well, thanks for digging into it, Jason. Appreciate it. Uh, there's no need to head to Washington, D.C. to check out some cherry blossoms. They're blooming right now. This is Jackson Park. Wow. Chicago Park District provided this new video. The Park District says there are more than 160 cherry trees along the Columbia Basin.